Yeah, welcome back. So we're, we're over here talking about Keanu Reeves' career. I mean, he's done uh, so many crazy things. The John Wick series, man, did that take off or what? And I finally, it took me forever, but I finally watched the first two. I still haven't watched the third one. And it just makes me appreciate him even more as an actor. So you think of him as John Wick. You know, they did a bunch of those. They did a bunch of Matrix. But you go back and look at some of the other movies. You know, I mean, he did some really ridiculous stuff. Right. And he did some really good stuff also. I mean, he, did, he has done so many movies. It's unbelievable. I mean, his range, it's, it's kind of like um, Jeff Daniels. Yeah. His range oh, yeah. Yeah. is so, he can go to the really goofy, silly, yeah. crazy stuff to these, these serious roles. He's really, really dedicated. So it was 22, almost 23 years ago that The Matrix first came out. So it has returned now. This is the fourth one. It's called The Matrix Resurrections. And we got a chance to talk to him. Check it out. Billions of people just living out their lives. Oblivious. It has been 23 years since we first visited The Matrix. Now The Matrix Resurrections reunites Keanu Reeves and Carrie Ann Moss for a mind-jarring ride. Hold on tight. I remember this. This Matrix is a hot cup of coffee. That's what I have to say about that. And do you guys remember when we, remember when we did the first interviews in the, in the big sound stage with the, it looked like Hollywood Squares or something. Yeah, thank you for reminding me of, the, of that press jacket. <laughs> that was really pretty cool. Um, yeah. How did I prepare? Well, we um, we trained. We started. We always start these movies with this incredible training space with trainers that are helping us learn how to do all the stuff. Keanu, do you have to sort of like teach your mind to like ignore the warnings to, to go forward to do some of the things you're supposed to do? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, because if you don't do that, then you don't get to do what you get to do. You know, and and. In uh, Matrix Resurrections, you know, if you don't do that, then you don't get to leap off a building. You don't get to have all of the kung fu, movie kung fu fights. You don't get to do all the motorcycle, you know, escaping and, you know. So, yeah, yeah you just work towards having that kind of storytelling and fun. It's my turn to believe in her. Part of me feels like I have been waiting my whole life for you. Married and a 54-year-old mother of three, Carrie Ann manages more than just the Matrix. I never am not thinking about them or, yeah. you know. I mean, I obviously, I, I you know, in, in the work I'm not, but there's, it's just always there. It's always there and it's always, you know, uh, a part of me. We're watching this movie, the reunion of your two characters and man, you really feel it. It's heart, heartfelt in the audience, you know, and I was wondering how it felt for you, how, how it felt for you guys to, you know, be back together again to do this. Yeah, uh, for me, it was super emotional. Um, even, uh, you know, it was emotional for the character and it was emotional personally. Um, yeah, it almost went beyond when they would say cut, you know, it was just so much to be reunited, to be together, to be telling this story. Um, yeah, it was, uh, it was uh, yeah, not a sadness, but uh, I don't know. Yeah. appreciation feeling it grateful I, I can understand what you're saying man I've, I've seen you guys for years love you guys the movie was great it was wow and, and that thanks a lot for joining us today oh thank, thank you. you yeah yeah he's a he's a great guy he's a great guy and uh, you know he talked about jumping off a building they actually did jump off a building. He jumped off a building. They jump off a building in this movie, which is like I, I've seen the behind the scenes thing. And you know, you have to talk yourself into being able to do this. And they, they found a way to, to make it safe, but you have to put it in your head that say like, it's safe, I'm gonna do this. That's what you have to remember with what some of these actors and then the stuntmen will do. You think, oh, well, this is just a movie. No, they really put themselves off in and sometimes Life and death situations. Yeah. The Matrix changed that whole, changed the whole game because in the old days they always had stuntmen come in and they always have a stuntman do it and then they bring the actor in. He started doing these. So he, he does he yeah, does a lot of the stunts. As oh on, yeah. On so his. he the Matrix changed the world in, in stunts and that sort of thing. So how do you do this? Do you take the red p pill or the blue pill? So so the blue. What's the good pill? Well, I can't remember. The, the I don't red know. pill takes you into this weird world, you know, to find out what's really going on and how the machines are running. Remember in the movie, he said, said, "Well, you got to decide anymore. Are you going to take the blue pill or the red pill?" So these little coffee things here from the tea lab in Lakewood, one is the red pill and one is the blue pill. Pretty good, huh? And what, and what does the blue pill do again? Do we know? 
Well, it sort of keeps you where you think you are. You, you, you think yeah, the world... That's probably, that's probably where I need to stay. <laughs> <laughs> I would try one on Saturday and one on Sunday. There you and, go. And, and see what you think. <laughs> I want to thank Joe Max Coffee out there, too. They, they had a big event with this. And everyone's having a lot of fun with it. And you can see this right now in theaters, which is the way I would go see it on the big screen. It's unbelievable. Or you could watch it on HBO Max on your big TV at home. So one way or the other. I'm so jealous. You, these interviews, you, Keanu Reeves just... 23 now, years ago, man, it was like he was a kid, and it's like, you know, you remember that? It, it makes you young again. It's, it's a fun movie, folks. Very neat.